Get ready with me while I tell you about my absolutely insane ex-boyfriend from high school. Get a snack, because this one's gonna be a wild one. So we met in a small town and he was like a mysterious new guy and he had this like really intense stare. Always felt like he was trying to see right into my soul. Yeah, total red flag number one, right? And get this, he had this weird habit of just showing up at the most random times and the most random places. Like he always knew where I was. Not sure if it was cute or creepy, but at 17, I was like totally into it. Like, uh, I'll never forget the time that he totally saved me from these random guys in a parking lot. Like, he just like whooshed over there, like insanely fast. Like, I thought I knew everything about him, but I guess he was like really into track or something. I don't know where he found the time, but I, I guess. The real kicker is he was like totally obsessed with my scent. Yeah, like he'd constantly say how I smelled like his favorite dessert. And I was like, okay, do I need deodorant or something? What is going on? Whenever I would wear like perfume and stuff, he would never compliment me. I was like, okay, bro, what is the deal? Oh, and did I mention he was like super old fashioned? Like the guy had a thing against technology and cell phones or something. Like he'd just show up in the middle of the night to my bedroom window, which is like, oh my goodness, so romantic, right? But now that I'm thinking about it as a grown woman, I'm like, just text me. Also, I'm sorry, Taylor, but I think he was the original tortured poets department because this man was like, I'm too dangerous, we can't be together, but he'd never even tell me why. He was just super dramatic. Which of course at the time to me made him just that much more interesting because I was like, ooh, like, why? I guess some guys just like love drama or something, I don't know. And then he had this massive family drama thing going on too. Not even normal family drama, like ancient, like really old something and other. But I was a teenager and I thought I could fix him, spoiler alert. I couldn't. I had this one girlfriend who was like, he's beautiful, he's beautiful, but stay away from him. But I didn't listen. But you know, that's just high school love, right? In the end, it didn't work out because he had to move away. Something about how it was no longer safe for me or whatever, but it was probably for the best, honestly. I mean, who needs a guy who's like literally afraid to get too close? Like literally will let you hold his hand because he says it'll just, it's too intense. So yeah, that was my experience with the most dramatic, overly protective, and slightly stalkerish boyfriend ever. But hey, we all have our phases, right? And I'm just glad I wasn't with him forever. Can you imagine being with a guy like that forever? No, thank you. Hit that subscribe button and come back next time because I promise you I have so many crazy exes, it'll blow your mind.